Good evening. Thank you for joining us. I'm Shelley Botod. Just after three this afternoon, a large vessel named K.E. Barker caused damage along the Fox River and Green Bay, hitting the city deck, the Main Street Bridge, and crushing a boat. Local 5 Steve Dent is live at City Deck with more information. Steve. Well, hey, Shelly, the Main Street Bridge behind me has opened back up, and it's a lot quieter now on the city deck than it was earlier this afternoon. Uh, after a, a huge freighter caused all sorts of commotion that destroyed a boat, there was a near miss. And think about what could have happened had there been kayakers in the path of that freighter, but thankfully, nobody got hurt. The back end tried to turn, but as it turned, it hit the docks and it flipped over a couple of kayaks and it crushed this one little boat, almost like an aluminum can. It was crazy. The K.E. Barker freighter stretches 767 feet long. And while the back end destroyed this boat, another part of the ship hit the left side of the Main Street Bridge. Then as it kept going, you heard this screeching and we looked and it sounded like it was hitting the bridge. Um, which won't go down anymore. Cars were stopped for a long time. But the K.E. Barker kept going. The freighter had left town. However, the Coast Guard got on the horn and eventually stopped this ship. Your boat is gone. Yes. Your boat is gone. We are going to interview the captain of the freighter to understand what he was thinking, how it happened, and try to understand basically the root cause of why this all occurred. Nikki Unger witnessed people jumping out of a boat. It's a miracle that nobody got hurt. Oh, thank God. I mean, it's something that we can tell as a story that was a crazy thing that happened on a warm summer day, and thankfully nobody was injured. But yeah, it was really remarkable how close they were. We were really a little nervous until they got up and got out of the boat. But for the people enjoying the city deck. The little boats and the big boats. Today will go down as an unforgettable experience. I got a show for lunch, so definitely crazy. Never seen anything like that in Green Bay. Now, one of the more amazing parts of this story to me is that the city deck behind me, it seems to come it to have come out of this just fine. I mean, I've learned that there's scrapes and red paint on that other side, and it will take some time to assess the damage to both the dock and the bridge. Live in Green Bay, Steve Dent, Local 5 News.